life for the kings and queens of ancient Egypt was a wash with riches and treasure beyond the imagination. Some of these artifacts are over 4,000 years old. Wow, look at this stuff. Can you imagine what it must have been like to live back then? Yeah, I can. The Egyptians totally knew the importance of style and class, so I would have fit right in. And this is the sarcophagus of the ancient pharaoh Tutankhamun. He was a feared leader who was believed to have mystical powers. Cool. Whoa! Check out these hieroglyphics. Weird. What's it say? The legend is that Tutankhamun was able to put hexes upon his enemies. Uh, the exact translation is unclear, but these writings are believed to be some sort of curse. That is beyond cool, man. I gotta write this stuff down. Why? So I can decipher it. It'll be like cracking an ancient computer code. <laughs> In other words, it speaks to his inner cyber geek. Well, I sure wouldn't want to be on the receiving end of one of his curses. Oh, come on. You guys don't actually believe in all that stuff, do you? <laughs> so close. Only a few more symbols to translate. Are you getting extra credit for this or something? No, it's a personal challenge. Tutankhamun may have been the king of Egypt, but I'm the king of codes. <laughs> Mrs. Porter said there might be a curse. Maybe you should. This is this about technology? Hard facts? What about some crazy legend? Yes, I got it. Cool. What does it say? To the defilers of my tomb, I now bestow eternal doom. Woe to you who read this verse. Upon you is the Pharaoh's curse. Oh, dude, you're cursed. Get away from me before it rubs off. Very funny. Seriously though, what's gonna happen? You gonna like turn into a cocker spaniel or grow an extra head or something? These warnings were put on the tomb to scare off grave robbers and thieves. That's all it is. Mm-hmm. Back me up here, Kira. Hey, I said you shouldn't read it. Don't blame me if all your hair falls out. You guys listen. Nothing is gonna happen from reading that curse. At last, I am awakened. The mighty Tutankhamun will rule this land. 5.30? I told my mom to pick her up at work. Ah! I don't believe it. Your new laptop. My games. My files. My life. It started. Tutankhamun's curse. She quit it about the curse. There's no such thing. So you know that, right? Yeah. And what I was gonna say. Uh, uh, stop! I must speak with you. What do you want? Don't hurt us. I have no intention of hurting you. I have never laid eyes on such magnificent beauty. Oh, thanks, man. I've been using this new moisturizer. Not oh. you, you dung beetle. Her. Your loveliness makes Cleopatra look like a homely peasant. Really? Wasn't she one of the hottest girls back in the day? Yes, but she cannot compare with you. Come with me and be my queen. Oh, I can, because I'm off to get a pedicure. But I will shower you with riches beyond your wildest dreams. Exactly what kind of riches are we talking about here? Gold, jewels, servants to wait upon your every wish. Yes, you can't. Shh. I'm listening. Thanks a lot. There's a strange creature in the city that doesn't come from here. He looks like a strong warrior. Keep an eye on him. We will determine if he is our friend or foe. Mm -hmm. The Blue Ranger. Send the Tyranodrones to attack him. Don't we usually need a reason? Yes. Strange, isn't it?
Oh, man. Oh. Guys, listen. I think you're right. Tutankhamen's curse is real. Ew. Dude, do you want to tell us from over there? You smell like weak old fish sticks. All this weird stuff has been happening to me. There's no other explanation. You may step through, my queen. Don't you think it's a little early for Halloween, Cassidy? You shall address me as Queen Casapatra. <laughs> I can't believe I used to live like these lowly commoners. <clears throat> my chair. Oh, Cass, what's with all this? You stinketh to high heaven. I find your odor most foul, peasant. Peasant? Are you losing it? No, actually, I've just found it. Someone who appreciates me, that is. Look at all this gold and jewels he gave me. Man, people called you shallow, but I always told them they were wrong. It's like I was the one who was wrong. Hey, come on. Keep on moving, pal. Don't feel bad, Ethan. Cassidy will never change. But she was changing. This whole Cleopatra thing has got to have something to do with that pharaoh. Got to find a way to break that curse. Maybe there's something we missed at the museum. Yeah, like some sort of counterspell or something. Hero, why don't you go back to the museum and see if you can find anything? Ethan, I think you and I should go to Dr. Owen and fill him in on the situation. Know if we can help, okay? So what do you think, Dr. O? Could this curse thing be for real? If there's one thing I learned from being a ranger, it's that anything's possible. What's the new project that Haley's working on? I don't know. She won't even tell me. <laughs> hmm? Guys, we got a mad mummy in the quarry. You two go help Kara. I'll contact Trent. Ready! Ready! Dino Thunder! Power up! Ha! Dino power! Yeah. Who dares challenge me? Super Dino mode! You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. And so am I. But how? I destroyed you. There is only one way to destroy the great Tutankhamen. <laughs> See me again! Huh? <sighs> Power down! Power down! Hey guys, thanks man. We owe you one. Not a problem. This whole thing is my fault. Look, he said there's only one way to defeat him. So we're just gonna find out what that is. Hold on. I found some more hieroglyphics at the exhibit. Maybe there's a counter spell in there. Yeah, it's worth a shot. Well, get cracking, King of Codes. Oh, 
man. Huh? Look out! Yeah. Huh. You okay? Don't worry, Ethan. You can break the curse. I just hope I live long enough to. Come on. Sweet. You're mine. Careful. It might be an even worse curse. Hey, that rhymes. <laughs> Tutankhamun's power cannot be matched on Earth, but only in the sky can you break the Pharaoh's curse. Great. I'll just use a pterosaur to fight it. I don't know, Kira. The curse is on Ethan. I think he's the one that has to break it. The last time I checked, the Triceratosaur didn't have wings. Ethan, you are about to owe me so big time. Come look. Whoa, check it out. Nice work. Wow. <laughs> Tight. That's for me? Yep, the latest technology, faster than anything I have ever built. That is so amazing. It wouldn't happen to fly, would it? Fly? No. Haley, we uh needed to fly. I see. And they couldn't have told me that before. Oh. I'm gonna stay and help her. Is your work? My queen, you deserve all the riches you desire. So true. Once I destroy the defenders of the city, everything will be ours for the taking. Hang on a minute. The Power Rangers defend Reefside. You didn't say anything about destroying anyone. But I must crush my enemies to achieve total domination. I'm not sure I'm on board with that. <gasps> not so hard, fool. That's 24 karat gold. Uh, hey, oh. you can't push him around like that. He is a servant. Lower than dirt. He may be low, but he wouldn't hurt anyone. Come on, Devin. We're out of here. Oh, okay. But my queen! Don't my queen me! I quit! <laughs> yeah. The Pharaoh will not be mocked! I shall tear this entire city apart! <clears throat> Looks like more trouble. But they're not finished modifying the bike. We better hold them off as long as we can. Okay. Ready! If he destroys the Power Rangers, you had better be there to collect their gems. Of course. We meet again, White Ranger. I shall! Man, that was harsh! When did they hook up? <laughs> Hovercraft cycle to the rescue! On one of those two lasers. Ah! Watch out. Ah!
defeat the curse. Never is a long time, baby. Sometimes I just love this job. Awesome. Yeah, all right. Now that was crazy. You broke the curse. I sure hope so. Curse has hydro regenerator. He's back. Whoa. Huh? Yeah. Not her too. I'll handle Elsa. We'll finish the freak right. <sighs> Yeah. 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 Let's try some Triassic power. Yeah. Yeah. Shield of Triumph, activate. Yeah. Yeah. Mesodon Rover, online. Team Red. Sorry, man. Tell you what, next time we'll play Tomb Raider. Okay, bad idea. Man, I'm just glad that stupid curse is broken. That was brutal. Speaking of brutal, can I talk to you a minute alone? Can we make this quick? I'm busy. Listen, about the way I treated you before, it wasn't very nice, and I just wanted to say that I'm I'm, you know what I mean. Wait a minute. Is Queen Cassipatra actually trying to apologize? Yes, and you're not making it very easy for me. Oh, I don't intend to. You have a lot of making up to do. Hey, Cass. I've uh, picked up that dry cleaning and also dropped off your videos. What next? A uh, decaf latte? Yeah, thanks. Looks like Cassidy has a spell on Devin and Ethan. <laughs> <laughs> 